The coronavirus has been steadily increasing throughout Asia, with China being the epicenter. In the United States, we have currently identified the second case, but with the volatile nature of this virus, we are destined to uncover more cases. In today's presentation, the coronavirus will be discussed. So what is the coronavirus? The coronavirus are a large family of viruses, and they mostly infect the upper respiratory tract. However, in some cases, lower respiratory tract illnesses may be sustained, such as pneumonia or bronchitis. More severe illnesses are common in those who have pre-existing medical conditions. These conditions include cardiopulmonary disease or a weakened immune system. And from what we have seen, they mostly affect older adults. Symptoms and diagnosis. So some symptoms for this virus include headache, fever, runny nose, cough, and sore throat, similarly to a common cold. To diagnose for this virus, laboratory examinations on respiratory specimen and serum may be conducted. Prevention and treatment. At the moment, unfortunately, there are no vaccines available to protect against the human coronavirus. The virus is usually spread through coughing, sneezing, and personal contact such as touching or shaking hands. Additionally, there are no specific treatments for illnesses caused by this virus. To relieve symptoms, one can take pain and fever medications, drink plenty of liquids, and thoroughly rest. And this is a warning. If you have recently traveled to China and believe you may have been infected, please seek a healthcare provider. If you found this video informative, please like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, thank you very much for watching.